Hi. A couple of years ago, we had a student called Ujwal. And Ujwal was, even though he was one of our good students, he topped the Triple IT Hyderabad exam and he had had an All India rank of 10. Even when the J main results came, or the J advanced results came, he was one of the toppers at CFL. Now, that astonished me because if I had to predict what would Ujwal rank be, he wouldn't be at the top of the list. When I asked Ujwal what he had done to prepare towards these exams, he said that I had written over 120 mock tests to prepare going towards the J main exams. 120 exams? That astonished me. And I said, how did you do that? He said, I would either ex write an exam consistently every single morning between 9 to 12. And there are days that I wrote the exams in the afternoons between 3 to 6. He said, I not only did this, I was consistent in my approach to review them. I took time to review the wrong answers like everybody did and plan my revisions based on that. But I also took time to prepare and review my right answers. I never heard somebody reviewing the right answers. And that is why I asked him, why? Why do you review a right answer? He said that every question had a time frame to be solved in. If it's an easy question, it has to be solved within a minute. If it's a harder question, it has to be solved within three to four minutes. If I had taken longer time for any of these questions, I would review it to see why did I take so long? And how can I refine it so that the next time a similar question comes, I solve it in the time frame that was allocated for it. And I thought that was, that was revealing to me, you know, with somebody reviewing the right answers so consistently. And he also said that I refined my strategy. I had a strategy and I refined it day after day after day. Now, this is what I've seen when I look back. Are all our toppers doing? It could be Sumit, it could be Kendrick, it could be Go On, Navneesh, on and on and on. Every year, what I have seen is that the toppers are giving one test mock test a day consistently, if not two. And this is what has taken them to be the toppers of Mangalore, toppers of Dakshina Kannada, toppers in the state, and get to the top colleges like ID Bombay, Chennai, and so on. Now, if you're a student listening to this, and if you're concerned or if you're thinking about what the toppers are doing, they're doing the same things. That is giving mock tests, reviewing the right and the wrong answers, and refining the strategy. There are a few more other things that I would also recommend or I would suggest that you consider as you prepare for these exams. One is consistency. You cannot give a mock test once in the morning, once in the afternoon, once in the night. Your body, your mind, and your spirit should be conditioned to the same rhythm. So you have to sleep at the same time, you get up at the same, pretty much the same time. And I would recommend that you have eight hours of rest a day. Eat good food, take care of your health, take care of your mental state, body, mind, spirit, in very good shape as you come towards this exam. Wishing you all the best and wishing you too are the topper in these exams. Thank you.